and I, I got at this in my book, Fire the Rabbit Hole, um, is that they need the cover of being an underground grassroots revolution where this is just kind of whispered about and you just hear somebody talk about it on a podcast and the, the host doesn't really push back on it or if they do, they very quickly retreat and you know they won't push the subject. If you If you challenge them, they will just either mock you or they will retreat. They won't defend their position and show their sources and have an open debate about anything. They need it to be a sexy, uh, like X-Files was a, a huge experiment in this, is to, X-Files is supposedly about FBI investigators. I love the X-Files growing up. This is why I'm very familiar with it. Um, but it's like, it was supposedly about UFOs and about the Pentagon covering up secrets about the UFOs. But if you actually watch the show, I, I revisited it a couple of years ago when I was investigating this stuff. It is just hardcore new age propaganda disguised as FBI agents researching paranormal activities. There's a lot of ancient Navajo and, and Aboriginal traditions and stuff. They'll just seamlessly work in all of these ancient myths and cultural um, urban legends and, and this kind of stuff. And it's all about being explored through the lens of a science fiction show about a conspiracy of the military hiding these secrets but it was actually basically an initiation into saying look at all of these um ancient secrets that you know if only we were brave enough uh we would explore and it it had that really and they pick like the most attractive people they can to be the protagonists and they're you know fbi agents so it's also sexy and it's like a government conflict that's happening and they, they really did a good job dressing mm -hmm. it up as this yeah, very james bond-esque exactly and and they don't want a plain disclosure open discussion uh, they want to leak things and then have this mass of uneducated people who are just going along with it which is sort of this this herd like mentality that they want they need the collective um, and then if you stand against them against these many whispering people who have no sources uh, you just look like a fool because um, no, nobody's going to provide a counter argument, but they'll all snipe at you. 